What's up, Keep Pounding Crew? Back today with another video. Keep Pounding! Today's topic is the Falcons versus our Carolina Panthers. If you like the video, if you like the channel, if you like the stream, hit that like button, hit that sub button, hit that bell, select all, leave a comment down below if you feel like doing so. And also be sure to check out the Facebook page, Keep Pounding in all caps, for polls, opinions, NFL news, reactions, and, of course, in-game posts. So you don't want to miss that. Also, Zoom chat is open on Sundays for games. Be looking on the Facebook page for the Zoom chat ID and password. Let's get into it. All right. Joe Brady has been fired, ladies and gentlemen. We're in a good position right now. Jeff Nixon has taken over. And I think we're going to see some adjustments. Now, the last thing you're going to see is any more audibles from Cam Newton because we just took away the one offensive coordinator that was handicapping Cam's progress. So I'm very, very pleased with the management and with Matt Rule in particular. Thank you very, very much for growing a spine and doing what was necessary to continue the franchise success. However, um, Joe, I wish you well. Wherever you end up, take what you learned with you. You're a good man, and uh, you just weren't the right fit for the job. So, best wishes to you, and we wish you the best of luck. That being said, our goals for defeating the Falcons. Number one, build an offense that works. Two, stop shooting ourselves in the foot. Cam said it several times in the press conference. Stop doing it. Three. Let's please, please, please play some defense. These teams have scored way too many points on us lately on defense because of lazy play. And we all know what player I'm going to mention. Or may not mention right now. He knows who he is. Step up your game. We love you, but step up your game. Alright, so... We got Dante Jackson on the IR. We got a couple players on the IR, including uh, CMC. So, we're in a position where we have got to win this game. If we want to play off spot. Now, I've run the simulation, and we're looking at a sweep against the Buccaneers, a win against the Saints, and a win against the Falcons will get us the division. That ain't going to happen if we can't pull a win off against the Falcons. Don't be that team anymore, Carolina. We have a nasty habit of losing games that we should not lose during a playoff run. We also have a nasty habit of winning games that will cost us a draft pick. We all know what game I'm talking about from last year that cost us an offensive tackle from Oregon. So don't be that team, Carolina. Be the team that's aggressive. Be the team that wants to win. Be the team that wants a playoff spot. Show me you want it. Otherwise, don't bother coming out in a uniform. Otherwise, don't bother. We'll tank and play for picks. Right now, I don't want to say the tank word right now. I don't want to. Because we still have a shot. Don't waste it. These teams that have upset these other teams this this past Sunday gave us a major gift. Don't throw it away. I'm telling you, don't 
Throw it away, Carolina. Don't do this. This isn't you anymore. With Joe Brady gone and Jeff Nixon in, our last problem is the offensive line. Now, my question to all of you, and you can answer this in the comments section, do we gamble with the offensive line that we have right now? Will that be enough to get us a playoff win? Put your answers down below. I want to read them. Thank you guys so much for the support. Thank you for all the new subs, all the new follows. I appreciate y'all. This is a family. Keep pounding, man. This is love. Going back to you. Keep pounding.